first off, like um, coming off of another win, you got to five one. Um, you know, just how does it feel to know that you're one win away from being bowl eligible? Uh, it feels pretty good. It, it's <clears throat> nice to come off of a big win, a uh, hard-fought win, and some facing some tough adversity. And uh, you know, it's a great feeling. And you know, it's you know we just take it like we have been all season, one and zero at a time. Now this time, one and zero means a lot more. We, we got to get a little bit of extra benefit when we go one and zero this week. So yeah, um, you guys have you know a really tough team ahead of you that's kind of faced a little bit of adversity. Um, you know, what what do you look at? What do you see in, in Florida State's defensive line? Uh, you know, Florida State's D-line, they're, they're like they always are. They're big and they're strong, and uh, they, can, they can move a little bit. So, uh, you know, it's a big task at hand, but, you know, I believe in myself and all the other guys on the line, and I know that we can handle that task, and, we've, and we're up for the challenge. I just, you know, we saw a, sort of a different side of John Saturday, a lot of running, you know, the offensive line, to have a running quarterback you know, like John, does that sort of surprise you? Is that going to bring a different aspect to this game? Uh, we've always known that John could run the ball. seems that uh, we've been in certain situations this year where he hasn't need, needed to run as much. And uh, he's been able to throw the ball. And, you know, for him to be able to, you know, show that he can run the ball, it brings another element to this game. And they're going to have to uh, worry about defending the run as well, just like they do, you know, when, when Kendall's uh, – our quarterback and uh, you know it's it's nice to be able to have that two dimension because it keeps the defense on their toes and keeps them backed off trying to figure out what's going on rather than just attacking on constantly. Yeah, the past couple of games it seems like the offense has, has gotten off to a slow start. You know, is that something that's troublesome or is that something that you guys can easily fix? Uh, I think it's just something I think it's something we can easily fix. Uh, you know, sometimes it's you know we gotta get into a rhythm quick. You know, this past week the rain uh, made it a little bit more difficult, but, you know, after we got settled in a little bit, we, we started, you know, hitting on all cylinders, and, you know, we just got to start fast and be ready once uh, 3.30 hits on Saturday. Yeah, you guys have played a, a couple road games this year, but down in Tallahassee, it seemed like a whole different aspect crowd-wise. Is it playing in a big stadium like that with a loud crowd, is that something that excites you? Oh, it's really exciting because, you know, uh, their stadium is a historic stadium. Everyone talks about how big it is, how loud it is, how they, they're always doing the tomahawk chop and they don't, they don't, like, they don't calm down at all. So it's exciting going into this game, you know. Uh, you just get ready for it through a week of preparation and, you know, you got the crowd noise pumping in during practice to get you prepared. But, you know, once, once you step on that field, you just got to tune it all out and start to play. Yeah, there's a like this team is different than any team I've been on since I've been here. We've got this camaraderie and this like just big this sense of like uh, you know togetherness that we count on each other. We count on the defense. The defense counts on us. That if one if a bad play happens, we know that we can make plays to get back into it or whatever. Just like we have all season this year, and there's just this confidence that <clears throat> we can do that against anybody. So yeah, to answer your question. Uh, you know, it's it'd be cool like it's it's cool to think of it that way, but you know, we have to still earn that earn respect from that. We still haven't beaten them. So, you know, we wanna be able to go down there and we wanna play a good game and we wanna win this game. So, you know, we're just focused on that. We're not really focused on the overall records or anything like that. We just wanna take it go into this game and be one and oh this week. Has that been tough, you know, going finally beating them and especially going to Tallahassee? Yeah, I mean we're we're pretty excited. We've got a great opportunity this week to you know, do play a really good game and beat a really good team. Have you watched? Did you watch much of film already on Florida State? You know, they kind of got the thing, some things turned around against Miami. You know, what do you see when you after watching that? Kind of what they come from? You know, uh, uh, they. I mean, <clears throat> they're very athletic on defense. Like I've wa I've watched a pretty good amount of film so far this week, and they're very athletic. And you know, they make plays sometimes that. Uh, there's been there's been some time they've started off the season slow I've noticed but they've picked up the slack in the past couple of weeks and uh, 
you know, they're, they're kind of hitting on all cylinders. So we're going to get their best team this weekend. I mean, we're prepared for it.